today i'll present before you a very different uh, raw style video of classic indian village style cooking authentic and very classical by using some earthen cookware we'll cook one very delicious uh, chicken curry in fact and this chicken curry is very typical to orissa the state of orissa and you will love it once you prepare this chicken curry hey guys i'm subhankari and i welcome you all to my channel sus food corner i hope you all are doing great in your lives and if you are new to my page do subscribe to my page and do not forget to tap the bell button and thank you all for loving my channel so much and liking my video so much so let's start with this awesome recipe as i said i am just uh, cooking this video in a different style i have used a traditional chula and it is actually ignited by some wood uh, we call it uh, lakdi ka chula and i have used a traditional earthen cookware and i could not shoot the starting part and uh, i live in a flat and i have a very uh, access less to open space so i have a small uh, not actually very small i have a good spacious balcony and so i have used that space to cook this recipe for keeping this chula because for this chula i need open space so i have first used a earthenware and heated some mustard oil and in that i have just fried some medium size 4 to 5 potatoes with skin on and then once it is done i have removed them and now this uh, oil is super hot so to it i have added some dry whole spices some cardamom some bay leaves few cloves and one cinnamon stick i'll give the entire description in the description box actually i did not mention this in this video because i did not want this uh, video to be interrupted by those things so it's actually a very different experience for me so i just thought to share with you this classic raw footage and now when this um, whole spices are sputtered in oil i'll add the sliced onions these are around uh, medium to large size two onions and i'll fry these onions till they are golden brown and you can see how i'm adjusting the flame here by removing and inserting this woods like uh, i had some dried uh, wooden sticks and so i have used them and when my onions have turned golden brown i have added some turmeric powder and some red chili powder now i'll mix everything and this recipe holds good if you cook in normal um, kitchen like ours the urban kitchen but this setup this environment and this smell of this fumes uh, smoke that totally transform this dish to something heavenly and once they are done i am adding the marinated chicken i had marinated this chicken with some turmeric powder some salt some lemon juice and some chili powder and now i'll add crushed ginger garlic and green chilies now i'll mix everything by i am actually using a wooden spatula here because this total uh, cookware is earthen cookware and uh, i am somewhat very new to this style of cooking i have cooked obviously but very few times especially we cook this type of cooking if we go on picnic or get together but this type of cooking needs time and patience so it's very limited to certain areas but nowadays also in villages in indian villages very rare use of this chulhas are there all have shifted to the lpg style cooking but yes this traditional style and this flavor has no match to a urban style cooking so i just thought to shoot a video in this classic raw style i'm actually sitting on the floor and i am cooking on this earthen cookware i'm shooting for you so i have just uh, cooked this uh, chicken in this with the spices for good 7 uh, to 8 minutes and this takes time while you cook on this earthen cookware and especially in this chula because the flame is uh, has to be adjusted otherwise it will stick to the bottom So now I have added the fried potatoes, and fried potatoes with skin is a speciality of the state of Odisha. People here love their potatoes, especially when it is fried and it is mixed with chicken or mutton curry, and it obviously absorbs all the flavors of this chicken curry. And now I'll cover it and let it cook. Uh, the chicken will cook in its own juices for good seven to eight minutes, and after seven to eight minutes, I'll just add some salt. I had already added some salt uh, at the time of marination for the chicken, and I'll just add here accordingly, and now again mix it. 
I am actually uh, mixing this very carefully because as I said uh, I have a balcony it is a uh, granite covered balcony so I have placed extra piece of black granite I had a piece left of my um, some household work and on that I have placed some sand and on the sand I have placed this chula and on the chula th there is this earthen cookware so I need to be extra careful and uh, if you are planning ever to cook in this type of setup be extra careful and cook in open space because there will be a lot of smoke so now after um, I covered and cook for good six to seven minutes more I'll add the tomatoes I have just roughly chopped them and I'll not mix them I'll just add and cover and let them cook till the tomatoes soften it will take more five to six minutes and you can see the flame how I am adjusting it I am just taking out some pieces of wood and then I am just inserting some more if I need a higher flame and after seven to eight minutes this tomatoes have softened and now I'll mix them and this style of cooking is very raw uh, you might have seen I have not added any extra spices like powdered spices and all some basic raw spices some basic flavoring agents like onions uh, ginger and garlic and some oil and chicken goes in that's it nothing fancy and still then this flavor as I said is not compare cannot compare with anything and as I said I had started shooting quite early and now the sun has risen and as because it's summer here in India so the heat is really intense even in the morning so for that reason I had started early and if I had started late then it would be near impossible for me to sit here and actually cook for you and now you see I have added some water for the gravy and I'll slightly mix it very carefully because the amount has increased and how beautiful this curry is looking after the sun rays are directly falling in this curry it was actually very beautiful I hope I have captured everything for you in my camera and now I'll mix it and I'll cover it and let it cook and it will just take more I mean 10 to 12 minutes because in this type of cooking uh, the cooking time increases and see the curry has started to bubble and it's looking good now I'll just sprinkle I've just sprinkled some fresh coriander leaves and see how carefully I'm just removing it from heat and now I leave it for good 10 minutes and after 10 minutes I'll just show you how nicely my curry has been prepared you can see here the smell the aroma I can't upload that but I hope I have uh, done justice to this video by showing you everything I could so anyone who is watching this in lockdown I hope you have a blissful day and your mood just enlightens by watching this video I hope you have liked my uh, effort to make this video do give a thumbs up share with your family and friends and do not forget to subscribe to my page see you in next video till then stay safe love life and happy fooding